My name is Valerie Mbakadura Moore, and I'm going to talk about my role and some other stuff about the video I'm going to do. Um, how I, when I was doing my role, I was kind of happy, but I had to put on a sad face and cry. It was kind of hard because I, I kept on bleaching because I was so, so happy. So I got it, kept a um, happy face as if they took away something from me. When they were taking away my dad, I was so broken hearted. I didn't know what to do. I had a drag struggle to get him back. It was so unemotional place. So I had to go, I had to stretch my hand and it was kind of painful. I was falling, but I had to raise myself back up. And then when I had to go hug him when he came out from prison, it was kind of easy, but at the moment hard. But when I figured it out how I should do it, I did it perfectly. It was so emotional, but I noticed that if you want to do something, you need to put the strength, the passion, and everything you got to to do it. If you don't have the passion, the love, and the strength, you ain't gonna make it. So I realized that if I do this, what's gonna happen to me in the future, and I had to do it with all my mind and strength. The person that sang it was really nice. It was like a song that I've heard before, very lovely. Likely, you could listen for it, listen to it a thousand times. It's nice. And Monty and I understood about the videos that it's about the 1960s and the background, how it was, how they did it. It was so lovely. I was surprised. Hey, my name is Ibn Isaacs, the production manager for the video organized by Kitty Number. Basically, what spurred me to working for this project was simply because the song had this in-depth creativity and relevance. So it motivated me into assembling a crew that was going to bring out the essence of the song. And also we wanted to beat the regular standard of making gospel videos in and out of Nigeria. So I think generally it wasn't easy though, but we killed it. Yeah, from Nelson the director to KD to the customer, the characters. Every scene, every scene was beautiful. Trust me, you will regret watching it. My name is Obilo Juliet Fatima. I played a role as a mother. Fighting because it's something I've never done before. My challenge with this video was uh, it wasn't really that easy. I was at first I was just struggling to you know be in character. I saw the video. It was something you know it amazed me. I was happy, I was overwhelmed. I was like wow, seriously, the video is awesome. And Nelson Bright did a great job as a director. Please, my people out there, you need to watch this video. I am John Rosambo by name. I work with FC Wears and we're the stylist for the video organized by KD. I actually played a role also, a prisoner, which was very, very difficult for me because I haven't done that before. Even if this is my second video with the director, and just as I call him, Nelson Bright. But the costume making, I had, we had little challenges based on making the caps and the uniforms for the colonial people those days. It was a very short time, like three days to set. So it was very difficult getting all the materials together and making it. Um, Basically, the song inspires me because it's about praising God, which we do all the time. It's not about praising Him when you're in difficulties. You just have to praise Him whenever you are or whenever you have the chance to. Okay, watch out for the video, Organedo by KD. To the videos, and Nelson and I was like, man, I want to do. I want you to give me this sixties and uh, kind of look this that that that. But thank God after everything, 
the whole shit, the whole thing came very well. And the song is very interesting, a bit very good. And the artist is Barry. He's a good artist. I enjoy the song and I enjoy working with him and Nessie Bright. Thank you. FC, where is a rap? I'm at. <laughs> Hello, everyone. My name is Doran Clinton and we're here to talk about um, the song Ogenedo. Um, not just being the producer alone, um, I was part of um, the whole process, making of the song, arrangement and all. Um, I could say um, Katie Numberi, very, very troublesome, I must say. <laughs> um, but so far, I, I knew it was, a, it was a, a, a hit from the first day I heard the whole idea and the song, so we had to put things together with, with a blend of um, um, hip hop and a local um, high life kind of song, sound rather. And, and I knew it to work. And the video, um, I must confess, it's, it's a wow. You really need to watch it. You really need to see the video. You will thank me later. Okay. My name is KD. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, my name is KD Numberi. Um, I wrote the song Ogenedo. Ogenedo is one of my favorite songs because I wrote that song when I was in a time of pain. I just buried my dad. And, but I thought about it, I was encouraged when I started dwelling on the scripture and I realized that most times I, I, I could be ungrateful only thanking God when good things happen. So as a practicing Christian, I know that I'm supposed to thank God when things don't also go well because all things work together for my good. So I wrote this song, I think about 4 a.m. in the morning, I was sleeping and I just, I woke up from sleep and had this inspiration to write down. So like someone was just speaking to me in my ears and I just started <clears throat> writing down the verses. Ah, my choice of video director. Okay, I saw this ragamuffin walking on the street and I stopped by and I said, hey, Nelson. Sorry, what's your name? He said, my name is Nelson. He said, are you okay? He said, he's all right. I said, you look talented. How can I help you? you know, I, I see something in you that I, I want to help. I want to make your life better. <laughs> and then he says to me, he says, uh, yes, I'm a video director. And then, you know, at that moment, I just had this light bulb inspiration. Uh, there was this light from heaven that says, Nelson is the one. And that's how I chose Nelson as my video director. Just joking. <laughs> I've known Nelson for a while, way back in 99, 2000, thereabout. And one thing I, I realized about Nelson is that he's serious with his job. That's one thing I, I look out for. And he's very detailed. So we wanted to shoot something different from the regular um, Christian or gospel music videos that are around. And I thought, who I, I looked around and I said, who will be able to give me something different? And Nelson was the obvious choice. Hi, I'm Nelson Bright. I'm a filmmaker, director for KD Numberia's Organedo video. Um, the storyline for the song was, um, it's, the, the, the video is set in the 60s and it's about a middle class family and a man that he's pulled away from his family and everything that he holds there. The song is very powerful emotionally. It has a peak, you know, Ogenedo, Ogenedo. And it's, it's happy, it's sad, it's inspirational, it's all of these things. And the challenge was to communicate these things visually, the kind of visuals that will match up the emotion that he was invoking when he reached that peak. So I thought of the story and um, the hope part, I was like, okay, Let's put, a, let's tell a prisoner story and let's tell a prisoner in the 60s story and let's tell a prisoner of a middle class family something about somebody in a, in a situation of despair and having to come out of it and be reunited with everything that he loved and hold there. So that was the, the decision we made for story. So I wanted to communicate that African feel as well. So we um, chose to 
do it like tales by moonlight you know a man the old african tradition of storytelling under the tree the children and that was the few we went for it and had all the village elders you know joining like the whole community it took the whole community to make the video thanks to the ogonda family for letting me use their 60s place we had to go around portaco we drove around portaco for like two days looking for the best location that still had that 60s architecture is because we, we didn't want to do it i didn't want to do it a one day shoot we shot it film style because i'm a film person and the song had a lot and in order to communicate that i didn't want to rush in set and rush out i wanted them to kill the performance so i was excited working on the project because the first time i heard the song i loved the song a lot of people loved the song i had people calling me like hey i heard you're the one directing ogenedu man you know so i was getting positive feedback from the song before i even i even worked on it and my friend called me she said oh, my aunties love the song you know i love the song so I was like, oh, you know, I love the song as well. So I was excited to work on the project as well as the crew members who love the song too. So it, it was it was fun and it was it was exciting having to bring KD's vision to to visuals. It was really interesting. I think for all the support I had about we worked with about 50 people and my production manager um, you just heard from him, Isaac, he was fantastic. I mean, it would have been impossible to put it together. We had Charles Bull, technical director on the project. He gave us a crane. He had a dolly and a track and a blowing machine. We had some people running around, puffing smoke in the corner. You know, there was a lot of elements that you don't get to see that we, you know, put in to make the picture that Telemundo dramatic um, feel. Because, you know, we needed to do that to communicate the the, the the feel of the song that he had in his mind so overall i'm i'm happy to have worked on it i hope you enjoyed enjoy it take my word for it it's good you know small project 1.5 hmm? in case you want to um, do your own um organedo type of video anyway it was fantastic and as in what we what we spent the the community we shot in abuna they were really supportive you know, in helping us, if not the budget, we probably would have gone up to like two point something if we had to pay everybody that participated in the project. But they were very supportive, they were very hospitable, and you know, we were able to achieve the video. Check it out. Keep watching, keep keep your dial on. The video is coming on shortly, you know. So <laughs> tell me what you think of it. Hashtag Ogenedo, hashtag Nelson Bright. Do, do, do. Again, Edo. Again, Edo. My name is Kaden Umbera. Keep watching this station.